like this this vlog of the week in the life of a nursing student for my first week of third semester of nursing school i am in my third semester out of five semesters so i decided to do a little vlog of the whole week for my first week of it i hope you guys enjoy and let me know if you like it um so i can do many more or like any other ideas you can comment down below any other videos you would like to see so i hope you guys enjoy and don't forget to subscribe and follow me on instagram hi guys my name is teresa um i'm a nursing student and i do videos based off nursing school and any tips advice um and now i am trying to start vlogging like i did in the live a week in the life of a nursing student and so i do start my third semester out of five tomorrow yay so today we today's monday we didn't have school because of martin luther king day it was a holiday so we do start tomorrow till tomorrow tuesday so i have my orientation tomorrow but the, um I, was, I wanted to start the video like today monday um so the teachers did put up like like the syllabus and stuff so i am going to currently like i already printed all of this that they put up so i'm currently going to be um transferring all the information to my planner all the dates and yeah have to start so then tomorrow we have orientation yeah i'm gonna take you along on my first week of third semester i know i look like a mess right now i look dead <laughs> but um i just got back from work and then i'm now i'm just i printed out everything and now i'm going to start putting in stuff into my planner so i hope you guys enjoy this vlog and it's gonna be my first time vlogging like a week so i hope you guys enjoy i will be taking uh ob and peds and research this semester I completely forgot to mention that in the beginning for those who are new that is what i'm taking this semester and this is a semester i've been looking forward like since i started the program because i mean i feel like everybody loves the babies and um i'm interested in the NICU so i'm really i've been waiting for the semester so i'm hoping for a great semester so i really like how they're doing the calendar this year like they're actually putting like our whole week everything we would do each day i actually like i'm liking that they usually kind of don't do this you see they have each week already planned out which i really like because usually we would just have like the syllabus like this like you find it <laughs> like this we will usually have it like this and so I'm actually really loving this, like, more organized, more like the week planned out and everything. And then what I'm also liking is that this semester, they're actually putting, like, each week. So, like, this week, week one, we'll be covering unit one. And they have, like, the objectives that we have to get from the chapters. The content we'll be covering, learning activities we will be doing. Uh... I really like that like it's already set like what we have to know objectives content and learning activities for each unit each week because we do a different unit every week so i'm really liking that too so i also already did start pre-reading my chapters for this first week so i already like have a few notes done for the week because you know we don't like being behind so yeah, so I'm going to be putting my little tabs. So this is how I usually like do my tabs for each chapter because I do my, like I always kind of do my own notes um, plus the study guide that upper classmen usually like give to us, not give to us, but like send to us um, to help us out. But I usually always do my own notes. So I always like put chapter one, whatever chapter number it is, that's what I usually do. So that's what I'm doing right now for the chapters that I have um, read for this week. So these are the only ones I've read so far. Um, but I still have, like, obviously, like, a lot to read. So, yeah. This is basically what I do for each chapter that I read and do notes on. 
Yeah, like there's chapter one, there's chapter two, which I was actually reading earlier. And then there's chapter three. Sorry for the image. And then there's chapter five. So yeah, I'm hoping to do, obviously I'm gonna have to finish all the other chapters, but yeah, this is so far what I have. So now I'm gonna be adding my little calendar and all the important dates into my planner so I can be ready. I kind of already added, but just like work stuff. But yeah, I'll be adding everything that I need to put on my planner. Good morning, guys. So I'm currently on my way to get some coffee because we do have orientation today. Um, yeah, we currently have orientation at 8.30. So I wanted to get some coffee before it started. Um, I'm excited. Today's our first day. You know, getting ready for the first day of school. Hey. <laughs> Bye. Bye. I'll text you. Okay. I got my coffee. <laughs> so now I'm gonna wait for orientation to start. And yeah, orientation is from 8:30 to 1 p.m. today. Orientation of third semester. So let's see how it goes. Hi. Hi guys, good morning. So today is Wednesday. I know I look crazy. I just showered because I do work today. So I have to start my day a little bit earlier than yesterday since I do um, work and I don't have class. So today will just consist of me studying and trying to get a lot of reading done. Uh, before class next week um, because we are going to cover everything we didn't cover this week since we didn't go because of Martin Luther King Day so yeah there's like a lot of chapters to cover um, I did finish my chapter yesterday that I did um, it did take me quite a lot because I didn't get the menstrual like phases like the ovarian cycle and the uterine cycle so it took me a while but I finished <laughs> And well, yeah, I hope you guys have a great day today. Um, yeah, I will take you along to my job because I do work today. So I will take you along to that. I know that's something that a lot of you guys ask me about my job. So that'll be today. Since I go in at four, so four in the afternoon. So yeah. Oh, and then also my friend Monica. Yeah, we'll see her a lot because I'm always with her because she literally lives like three minutes from me and we both go to nursing school so we're always together so y'all see her a lot um on my vlogs or whatever uh she is coming right now she's gonna bring me starbucks and we're gonna have a study session just study together and stuff so yeah so since i really didn't get the ovarian cycle yesterday and the uterine cycle um yeah no sarah register rn is the best so I watched her video, I kind of understood more, and I did like my own little iPad notes. Um, if you follow me on Instagram, I post my notes on there, so you'll see this if you want them. Or if you want them emailed also, I can email them. Just leave your email down below or on my Instagram, on the, like, on the comments of the picture. And yeah, they came out pretty cute. I mean, I've been trying to use my iPad more like on stuff that I don't really understand. I 
So here I had just gotten home and I still had like a few things I had to do for school. So, you know, I still had to do it. Had my little coffee. Hi guys, good morning. Um, right now it's 6.30 in the morning. Um, I had to wake up kind of like really early, like to start studying. I don't have class today or anything, but I had to wake up early to get like a lot of studying done. I do this a lot because like, you know, like I said, like I work and like, I, I don't get behind, like too, too behind because of work, but I do feel like I could be doing more like stuff if I didn't work. So that's why I wake up really early and right now we'll, I have like a lot of things to do, like a lot of pre-reading to do for like next week's lecture on Monday. So that's why I wake, I woke up at 6.30. Well, like 6.20, but then I went to, like, do all my skincare, even though. But, yeah. So, right now it's 6.30. I'm going to start um, reading my notes. Well, making my notes and reading. So, we'll see how that goes. And then I'll probably make myself coffee in a little bit when I feel, like, a little, like, sleepy or something I'll make myself a coffee so yeah as usual and as usual <laughs> which is the name Monica I'm learning about STIs. It's fucking scary. You know, the, the vaginitis. <laughs> I'd be diagnosing myself and shit. For real. I just received these like stickers for my planner from Student Nurse Planner. Um, I always want to get their planner, but somehow, some way, I always like they always sell out. And like I had seen, they were selling just the stickers that go with the planner, and like you know, I had to get them. They're so cute. It's like mental health quiz, paper, exam, essay, group, sim lab, project. Geriatrics, surgery, senior rotation, NICU, labor delivery. I'll be using these. Dinner day, lunch day, payday, brunch, date night, shopping, birthday, laundry. So cute. Study, clinicals, workout, cook, pediatrics. I'll also be using these. They're so cute. Exam. Med surge. Respiratory therapy. Dinner date. This is so cute. The dinner date. It's like a little stomach. Appointment. Study time. These are so cute. Pete's, NICU, OB, mom, baby. All the types of rotations we have. So I put my stickers and oh my god, like how cute. Like Sam stickers, so cute too. Dinner date. <laughs> so cute. Let me show y'all. Pete. They even have like the NICU labor and delivery. Pete. So freaking cute. I love it. So I'm about to make some green juice. I just got back from working out. So time for some green juice. So it's Friday 
recently Friday and I woke up at 6, took a shower and then immediately started studying and Monica came over as always so she also woke up at 6 to start studying because we had class at 9. So then we went for Chick-fil-A to get some breakfast before class because we hadn't ate anything. So we got Chick-fil-A and then we've been studying since 6 in the morning. It's right now, it's about to be 9. But we have research class, so we'll see how that goes. And Monica is over there doing her makeup, so she don't look to death. So yeah, we'll see how research class goes. Hi guys, so we got out of our research class. Um, I know I'm like so short, but um, we got out of our research class. Um, it was our first time in research, so... It was okay, I mean, I don't expect like for it to be too hard. I feel like it's just a lot of assignments and as long as we don't procrastinate and we get those assignments done like in time and don't like leave it last minute, I think we should be okay. Um, she did go over like a lot of information, like a lot. Like, like literally she went through every single assignment and I'm, we're just sitting here like, <sighs> it was a lot of information to process. like. All the stuff that we have to do and like i said i don't really know what to like i you did not know what to expect with my research class like like what exactly to expect before i went in but now i understand like it's just like it's like a lot of assignments individual and group assignments that develops like that eventually like is our big research project so yeah i mean it doesn't sound too bad as long as i like i said i feel like if we don't procrastinate we'll be okay um my the class was from 9 to 11 50 but she did end it like maybe like 20 minutes earlier and right now i'm in line for my covid test um we have to get covid tested to like go to clinicals and stuff so here i am in line waiting and they don't hurry so yeah i just got here and yeah pretty much uh all i did was like wake up at six in the morning i studied from six to nine and then well we actually went to get chick-fil-a breakfast and then um yeah we were studying since six in the morning like monica got to my house at six in the morning um and yeah pretty much that was it and then we we're in class like where i was just like a lot of information was like i got a whole headache because it was so much information she was like telling us like over the assignments that are due throughout the whole semester so we were just like you know overwhelmed but it'll be fine they're all due like every like week there's something due so it will be fine and yeah so now i'm just waiting here for my covid test we'll see how that goes <laughs> can't really see me because i'm like in the dark i put my lights on in the car but um i'm going to go eat with my um boyfriend um we're gonna have like a little dinner night we kind of do this on fridays since you know it's like the week and it's ending uh so yeah we're pretty much oh my car looks there we're pretty much gonna go um have a little dinner day i don't know if we're gonna get sushi or we're gonna go to cheesecake factory i don't know yet but yeah, we're gonna go. I like got ready so quick when he told me I was like, oh, I'm ready to get out because I'm so tired of studying. But yeah, so that's what we're gonna go do. And yeah, I'm just checking up on y'all. Um, I did finish reading my chapters, so maybe when I come back, I'll probably still do like, like a little bit of like a few assignments that I need to turn in for research, so I don't have to like be like um, procrastinating how I said earlier and actually get them done so yeah as usual i'm gonna watch her fetal circulation video because that's what i've been doing i know i highlight everything i've been trying to figure this out i'll probably do like a little review about like the fetal circulation and post it on my instagram so you guys can see but that's what i've been doing all morning you see i was going over like this the stages I also like went through what happens like at let me find it. 
what happens as the fetus fetus grows. It's really interesting. I'm actually like really enjoying this chapter. Hi guys, so I am gonna close my video today, Saturday, because I just feel like Sunday to just catch up on things for the next week for the new week of school. So I hope you guys enjoyed my first week of third semester. Um, let me know if you guys like the vlog so I can know if I should make more or any other ideas. Um, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it.